to see counterterrorism measures in Bangladesh. Good afternoon, everyone. Uh, I am Mohammed Shadlal. Uh, thank you very much. Um, and uh, I represent Glasgow Caledonian University. I am a PhD student, and I also represent my supervisor, Dr. Mahdi Zahra. Um, today's topic would be the counter -terrorist, terrorist measures legislation in the UK, mainly UK, because I'm a PhD student based in UK, and the rest of the world, other provisions, and finally following my country, where I'm really from, Bangladesh, what they can learn from this, whether these measures, they are heading to the right way. Um, we all know this, terrorism is a global problem. Uh, politically, everything. Uh, just, uh, you know, uh, we enjoy even more movies on terrorism. So it, it, it's something we cannot really ignore. So basically, this is a, a legal matter, which is called mostly on control order combinations. That is plainly, simply, because uh, um, I'm, I'm not really sure if I go through in a, a, a legal definition, uh, you would understand that very much. So I, I, I'll simply, I'll try myself uh, to make it uh, as simple as possible. Control order is exactly unlimited detention. So you don't have any lawyers, you don't need any reasons. If the counterterrorism team believes that you are some kind of uh, uh, involved with terrorism, they can fetch you in and uh, detain you um, uh, uh, unlimited uh, time frame. Um, the purpose is very good. It's very good because we need to eliminate terrorism. There is no question, there is no compromise about it. But the, perhaps the process and the procedure might be you know, a subject of criticism. So uh, first, I, I, I need to uh, say some words about Bangladesh. Uh, it's, we are a country we're very near to India. So the terrorism problems also uh, can escalate in our country. So the government has enacted Anti-Terrorism Act 2012, which is more like, a, as I said, and if you can see, a carbon copy. Uh, it, it, it would say a copy paste of British legislations and American legislations, their procedures. There's, there's nothing new in it. So uh, uh, I would very much doubt whether it fits in, suppose you buy a cloth, if you don't measure the size of that cloth, or does it even suit to you, uh, you just buy it. And then you, you realize that this cloth is not fit for you. So it, it, perhaps this sort of uh, thinking I have tried to bring in in this research. Moving on. So what is control order? I, I, I'll not go to details because of the time restrictions. Mm -hmm. But control order, as you can see, uh, the, the uh, highlighted line in, on, on, on the protecting members of the public from a risk of terrorism. As I said, uh, we cannot compromise on terrorism. We cannot take that risk. Like if, um, if I can say, if there is a fire in the building, we, we cannot ask uh, how much would be the loss, should I go now, should, can I go 10 minutes later? Everybody will laugh. Do you want to save your life or not? If you want, go run. So maybe control order is a, a conception, a philosophy based on that you know, emergency um, situations. So moving on. Um, features of control order. 
as I said, once again, I, 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 um, I'll, I'll make it very brief. That is un some features, unlimited detention, no lawyers, because uh, there might be some arguments for it, against it. For is, suppose you're uh, suspecting on somebody, if you can ask for the lawyers, it will delay, it will lengthen the time and the procedure. So you cannot afford really that kind of risk. The against, well, we are human, human beings. We, we, we cannot really fetch in somebody into the uh, terrorism cell and say, we will decide what to do with you. That is not justice. That is the very terrorism way what the terrorism and the terrorist might be uh, dreamed of. So moving on. As I said, the truth, the easy option, the easy <laughs> option. Is he, is he uh, uh, suspected? Has he committed the crime? Is he involved with terrorism? Ah, oh, come on, don't waste that time. We cannot afford that kind of time. So the easy option. And also, uh, this is a British con uh, uh, concept that written plot, and it was later found out without a beyond reasonable doubt that it was a clerical error. There is a, a place called Hood Green in central London. Uh, in a particular case, it was found out. It was not even uh, some kind of uh, judicial error. It was a clerical error. So let me explain it to you. Suppose somebody's name, my name is Muhammad Shah Jalal. So if I replace or the uh, clerk of the terrorism uh, cell, he uh, uh, misprints the name Muhammad, not Shah Jalal, Muhammad Karim, Muhammad Shan, this kind of name, you brought in that named person in the terrorism cell and for unlimited detention. Can you imagine? Is it, is it justified? Is it reasonable? No, perhaps. Um, and further controversies, as you can see, uh, the, 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 the facilities they will be in, uh, when you are under control order, electronic tagging, that means chip in, in, inside your blood cell, uh, no passport, live at one address, curfews, restrictions on visitors, no internet, and some going on, means plainly, and explaining simply, you will not have any rights, any freedom. You will like, more like, what can I say? If you are being uh, accused, like an animal perhaps, locked in a cage. <coughs> right, moving on. So the control order, so that is Counter-Terrorism Act 2005. Uh, we need to remember that the British provisions are followed by the Americans Australians and the rest of the world, even my tiny country, Bangladesh, which is far east. So has the law developed or has the law, because you see the provisions, the judicial system must go on, must develop case by case. Uh, uh, maybe uh, it can be said it, it might be like an antivirus, update, 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 update. It, it cannot stuck in one place. So the law lords, um, in, in, in Britain, the lords, the master of rules, um, the uh, highest entity person, uh, issued a string of important judgments in 2007, and they questioned that seriously, that two points are seriously missing, which should be the fundamental of any law, not, not the terrorism law, any law, uh, that is right to have a fair trial, which is missing, and there is no human rights. So as I said, no law can be ma made without human rights, not even a law in a co coffee shop. Because this is society, law is made for human beings. So everything under this or above this, outside of this, is arbitrary injustice. So you can see some of the cases, uh, home office uh, due to lack of the um, time, I, I can't really go in, uh, but uh, the, the Lord ruled to know an irreducible minimum to the all allegations. And, and, and um, uh, I, I don't know how, how many you people watch 
movies, obviously this is the United States, the home of Hollywood. So there is a, a movie called Closed Circuit by Eric Bena. You will have much more generalized concept that the guy was fetched in, the person, he was wrongfully convicted, and later the judge said he, was, he should have never been the place. So in Britain, there are at least 21 cases of this. And 19 people were awarded for some later remedies for these wrong perceptions. So the uh, uh, um, law lord, which is, who is uh, retired, I cannot say his name uh, because of restriction, uh, <coughs> told that it's a waste of time and it's a waste of um, uh, waste of judicial time, and it, it, it would be a, 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 a severe hit of uh, from uh, of disbelief for the next judicial or this kind of uh, cases because people will not trust in the justice system again. So moving on. So the future. It can't, be go, can't go on like this, because we need to remember the people who wants to wage, uh, uh, who wants to wage a fuss about terrorism, who wants to destroy the civilization. I, I, I do not have to name those persons who are being accused, really, really being, uh, as I said, for one minute, if we can say, the terrorist individuals they exactly look for this kind of excuses. That, you see what we do? We're right. You see, suppose we want to destroy the Americans or the West. You see, that's why, that's why. Come people join in our glorious organizations. So that's why the future is even much more dangerous. Because they have an excuse. The war on terror the talk of the decade, the most uh, important, uh, uh, important uh, atom of danger we have from the 9-11, which changed the political geography and everything other uh, problems, uh, which is the Lord Goldsmith, he, he, uh, he wanted to eliminate terror. You see, we are here to eliminate the terror. Eliminating the terrorist is not, not the solution of the problems. So he, he criticized this control order as an internal actions can, and also he asked a question, which is single uh, question of my research of, 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 of this presentation as well, that how successful they are now. Just imagine, if, if I take it uh, into myself, how successful, successful are we now? to eliminate terrorist, terrorism. The answer has to be big negative, not, not with just simple plain words, with, with bold italic as well. So, and a painful experience, suppose, one, one person who was in the terrorism cell, he used to uh, assist the, 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 uh, um, 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 uh, the, the CIA's MI5, MI6, I mean, the government secret agencies, who, who was a uh, member of Republican Guard. Sorry, I cannot uh, give his name due to restriction. He used to, uh, you know, pl pl by playing um, and, and taking the big risk that uh, 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 he uh, used to kind of betray Saddam Hussein. He used to give uh, uh, information to the secret agents that his sole purpose, that's what he said, his sole purpose was to eliminate terrorism, a new good world. And you see, at the end of the day, the secret agents, suppose, they suspected him that maybe, maybe he's not in the good side. Maybe he knows more. And they fetch in the terrorism cell and detain for like six months at least. And, he dis and they destroyed his social life. So maybe that's not it. So just one question I have.